two interesting questions that might have crossed the mind of a tennis enthusiast are, firstly, do tall players have an advantage over shorter players in tennis? And secondly, who are the tallest male and female tennis players of all time? Watch this video to the end to get answers to these questions. The 10 Tallest Tennis Players of All Time Tennis is a physically taxing game, therefore a player's body frequently becomes a natural advantage. It is believed that tall tennis players have an extra advantage. This assertion is, however, contradicted by the Grand Slam winner's history. Tennis success is not a function of height. Although tall players have powerful serves, their mobility can sometimes feel a little restricted. It has advantages and disadvantages. The list of the tallest tennis players in history is presented below. There is a different list of male and female players in this video. We start with the tallest male tennis players of all time. In fifth place, we have Dick Norman. The southpaw excels at doubles. Dick Norman is 6'8", 203 centimeters tall, and a native of Belgium. At the age of 39, Norman made it into the top 10 in the ATP doubles rankings. He excelled at strong left-handed ground strokes. He gained notoriety as the oldest player on the ATP Tour in his later years as a professional. In June 2013, at the age of 42, he retired. Yerzyanovic came in fourth place. One of the game's fastest servers, this 26-year-old Polish professional averages first serves between 130 and 140 miles per hour. His second serve, which travels at an average speed of 115 to 120 mph, is also leading. When serving, Yanovich is renowned for his distinctive high ball toss. Although Yanovich is only 6 feet 8 inches tall, he is incredibly athletic and nimble on the court. He defeated five top 20 players at the 2012 Paris Masters, including Andy Murray and Janko Tipsarovic, before losing to David Ferrer in the championship match. John Isner is the third tallest male tennis player of all time. With a height of 6 feet 10 inches, John Isner ranks third among tennis players in terms of height. Isner now holds the record for the longest match in professional tennis history. He accomplished the achievement during his first round encounter against Nicholas Mahou at Wimbledon in 2010, after 11 hours and 5 minutes of play over 3 days. Isner is a very quick server, in addition to having such a wonderful height. He holds the record for both the most aces in a set, which is 85, and the most aces in a professional match which is 113. The second tallest male tennis player of all time is Riley Opelka. Riley Opelka, the most recent player to emerge from the USA's manufacturing line of abnormally tall athletes, is expected to enjoy great success in the future. Opelka, who is 6'11", and is only 19 years old, has already experienced the thrill of holding a Grand Slam trophy after winning the Junior Wimbledon Championship in 2015. Opelka can serve at a constant 140 miles per hour. In the year 2015, he became a professional. Riley is currently ranked 25 in the ATP rankings and has won two ATP titles. Opelka's serve is his strongest shot, as you might think, and he plans to use it extensively extensively on tour in the years to come. And in the first place, we have Ivo Karlovic. Tennis player Karlovic is the tallest in the entire world. He and Riley Opelka are tied for first place. Ivo has the fourth fastest serve in tennis history, clocked at 254 kilometers per hour. He now holds eight ATP titles. He was the fourth player in history to have more than 1,000 aces in a season when he did so in 2007, which is 1,000 318. Now, we are moving to the top 5 tallest female tennis players of all time. The fifth tallest female tennis player of all time is Maria Sharapova. She is a tennis professional from Russia. She is regarded as one of the sexiest athletes in the entire sports industry, as well as one of the all-time most beautiful female tennis players. Millions of people throughout the world are admirers of Maria, and 
and recognize her for being an incredible athlete. She achieved the youngest female Grand Slam victory. At the young age of 17, she defeated Serena to win Wimbledon, which was extremely astounding. She is one of the most marketable athletes ever developed, receiving over 3,000 endorsements a year. Her height of 6 feet 2 inches places her fifth among the top 10 tallest female tennis players in history. Maria Sharapova was also a model and did photo shoots. In fourth place, we have Lindsay Davenport. She has the fastest and deadliest serve among women's tennis players. Lindsay stands at 6 feet 2 inches tall, which gives her the benefit of hitting aces with ease. She was able to maintain her top spot in the world for four distinct periods of time. Lindsay Davenport was not just among the tallest people, but also among the top tennis players of her era. She amassed 55 WTA championships and 38 WTA titles, three of which were Grand Slams. She also won the tour finals in singles and doubles while holding the world's number one ranking in each. She is also renowned for playing one of the best matches in the 2005 Wimbledon final, which lasted two hours and 45 minutes. Naomi Brody is the third tallest female player in tennis history. Tennis player Naomi Brody is from the United Kingdom. On the ITF women's circuit, she has won 20 doubles titles, 9 singles titles, and 1 WTA doubles title. She attained the best singles position of number 76 in the world on March 7, 2016. She received her highest doubles ranking of number 56 on May 22, 2017. The second tallest female tennis player of all time is Agul Aman Muradova. Together with Eva Hardinova, Agul Aman Muradova holds the record for being the tallest woman to ever play tennis. She's had a successful career, peaking at number 50 in singles and number 36 in doubles. Along with 12 ITF wins, she has also won two doubles WTA titles. Additionally, she has won nine ITF singles titles. Eva Hardinova is the tallest female tennis player of all time. Eva Hardinova's sole claim to fame is that she is the tallest woman to ever play tennis. Her tennis career has not gone well, and her highest global ranking to date is 168. Additionally, she has failed to claim any WTA singles or doubles titles. However, she has won 22 ITF titles in all, 22 ITF wins in both singles and doubles. Here are some of the other tallest male and female tennis players of all time. Tennis player Kevin Anderson hails from South Africa. At 6 feet 8 inches, he is among the game's tallest players. He garnered attention when he overcame Andy Murray at the 2015 US Open, but ultimately fell short in the quarterfinals. The best player from South Africa is Anderson. In 2011, he defeated Somdev Devaman in the South African Tennis Open final to earn his first of three career victories. We also have Marc Rosé. Rosé became a professional in 1988, but his greatest achievement came in 1992, when he won a gold medal for Switzerland at the Olympics, beating out many of the competition's finest players, including Jim Courier and Goran Ivanisevic. For the 6'7 tall Rosé, it was a significant accomplishment. Given his height, it is easy to think that Rosé was one of tennis's most potent serves. He was also the captain of the Swiss Davis Cup squad. Australian tennis player Guccione began playing competitively in 2003. He can make some powerful ground strokes because of his height of 6 feet 7 inches. Guccione has a powerful serve, but hasn't had much luck in singles despite five career doubles championships. Croatian player Marin Cilic is a tennis player who stands at 6 feet 6 inches. He became a professional in 2005, and in 2009, he won the US Open by defeating Andy Murray, the second ranked player in the world at the time. After it was reported that the 28 year old had failed a drug test in 2013, he gained notoriety. He overcame that setback, though, and won the 2014 US Open while defeating Roger Federer in the process. Venus Williams is also among the tallest female tennis players. She is wealthier than the most well known sports star. That must reveal a great deal about her outstanding playing style. She is vivacious and well known for treating all of her games seriously. A sportswoman with her level of determination is destined to succeed, and she has already done so. We also have Dinara Mikhailova. Dinara Safina was formerly the top ranked tennis player in Russia. This tall, slim beauty captured many hearts while letting her racket speak for 
for itself thanks to her exceptional height of 1.88 meters and her particular skill when it came to the French Open. Serbia has given the world more marvels than just Novak Djokovic. Anna Ivanovic has also demonstrated that she is more than just Djokovic's brilliant shadow. With her magnificent height of 1.84 meters and lovely grin, this outstanding performer has won over a wide range of followers all over the world. Her tenacity and will to triumph at such a young age are amazing. Aside from her talent, she also has a lovely face and long, fiery legs that are worth falling in love with. She is famous for her stunning looks and astounding talents, and we adore her. Being very tall helps in tennis, but it has its drawbacks. Those are the tallest male and female tennis players of all time. What other topic do you want us to talk about? Inform us in the comment section. Please like and subscribe. Thank you for watching.